For thousands of people and hundreds of companies, big and small, this was a near disaster. But this story is far from over. People actually started lining up this morning before 7 o'clock, hoping to get their money out of Silicon Valley Bank. Our, our business and tech reporter Scott Budman joins us now with the latest story of this bank. But this is an ongoing operation. This is a new bridge bank. Everything is safe and secure. The Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation arrived at Silicon Valley Bank headquarters with advice some coffee, sir. and donuts, telling nervous depositors in line they'll get their money back from the seized bank. And they did after a nail-biting weekend. Big relief, I guess. Oh, yeah, it was a big surprise because, I mean, you know, a bank is in for 25 years, and they were probably in for more than that, but that's how long I was with them. And uh, for this to happen, it's really, really surprising. The bank was seized by the feds last week after a two-day freefall sparked by investor panic. Today, account holders filed in two by two, many of them grateful startup CEOs who say the money they got out today means they can now make payroll. We hope to uh, have the money uh, as close as it can be to somewhere where we feel a little safer about it um, and learn a bit more about exactly what's going on because uh, things are moving very, very quickly. Safety was a theme here. One finance CEO told us her advice is don't keep all your eggs in one bank's basket. I mean, one, obviously, diversification is something that I think everyone is going to be looking at coming out of this, not keeping all of your money in one bank. She also says she is confident that in the future, venture capital money and startup money will have a relationship with banks here in Silicon Valley. By the way, the bank will reopen to give out more deposits tomorrow at 9 a.m., but the FDIC says you don't have to come here physically. You can go on to their website. It was a bit glitchy today. They say it should work more smoothly tomorrow. Live in Santa Clara, Scott Budman, NBC, Bay Area News.